The London Eye is one of the most popular and attractive tourist destinations in London. And in the same way, Apple's iPhone is one of the most popular mobile platforms. Both organizations fiercely maintain their brand, and to do this, they use control points. To get onto the London Eye, you must first buy a ticket, and this is their first control point. And in the same way with Apple, if you want to develop an application and put it on their App Store, you must first purchase an iOS developer program license. This is a $99 fee. It's just like buying a ticket. But even if you've bought a ticket, the operator doesn't necessarily want you to go onto their platform. So for example, with the London Eye, they have a security check built. This is so they can check that you haven't got anything malicious on you or that you're going to do anything damaging to the capsules. It's exactly the same on the Apple App Store. They call this application aggregation, and they use this to vet new applications for content and quality before they put them on the App Store. Of course, a typical mobile platform contains many, many different types of control points. And in fact, the more control points a platform owner has, the more power they exert over the rest of the ecosystem.